Hello everyone, welcome to Wi-Fi Learn. We are seeing the classifications of components that present in the electrical circuit. We can continue this. Unilateral and bilateral elements. It is on the basis of the waveform. Bilateral and unilateral elements are the elements which are classified regarding the voltage and current relationship if the voltage and the current are reversed. We can see the bilateral elements. Bilateral elements are the elements in which VI characteristics that is voltage and current graph are same if the voltage and the current directions are changed. Voltage and current characteristics are same if the polarity of voltage is reversed. Voltage is reversed and those elements are termed to be as a bilateral element. In bilateral element, the current flowing in either direction will be same if you change the voltage polarity. The best example of bilateral element is nothing but a resistor. If you apply the voltage in either direction by reversing the direction, your current direction will also reverse. So, if you apply a voltage like this, conventional current will flow from positive to negative. And in the case, and if you are applying the voltage, here and if you are applying voltage reverses and the current will flow from positive to negative even if you are in the bilateral elements if you reverse the voltages the current and the voltage relationship will be same it won't change those elements are termed to be as a bilateral elements examples of bilateral elements are high conductivity materials high conductivity material are bilateral elements and resistance is also a bilateral element if you reverse the supply then the current direction will remain same that is the voltage and current relationship would be same the another example of bilateral elements is transmission line the transmission line exhibit the property of bilateral since it is symmetrical about the either direction voltage if you interchange the voltage it is symmetrical about both the both the sides. Assume this is a transmission line. If you are reversing the sending end voltage or receiving end voltages, they both are symmetrical in both the ends. So, the transmission lines holds a property of bilateral elements property. We can say a point of linear and bilateral as all linear elements are bilateral where converse is not true. Where converse is not true. For a bilateral element, it should have the same property if you re reverse the voltage. If it should have the same characteristics, if voltage polarity has been reversed. The resistance has a linearity property, right? Resistance has a linearity property if you reverse the supply also, if you reverse the voltage. See, it is symmetrical about the axis and it is passes through the origin. It is a characteristics of the linear element as well as a bilateral. For certain bilateral element, if you take a triac or something, if you are reversing the voltage, triac, it characteristics would be of symmetrical about the origin. If you reverse the voltage, the voltage current relationship does not vary. It is similar as the positive cases right it is a bilateral element where this is not a linear element but this is a linear element as well as a bilateral element this is not linear where this is linear as well as bilateral so all linear elements are bilateral where converse is not true so linear element can be bilateral but bilateral element cannot be linear Example of that is triac. Triac is a bilateral element but it is not linear whereas in the case of resistor, resistor is a bilateral element and, and also a linear element. Right? Now let us see about the unilateral element. Unilateral element is an element that has a different relationship between voltage and current if, if the voltage directions are reversed. Okay, unilateral element is an element that has a different relationship of voltage and current if the polarity has been reversed. Has different relationship between 
voltage and current if the polarity has been reversed if the polarity is reversed it is the opposite of the unilateral element we can take an example of unilateral element as diode diode is a unidirectional device it conducts in only one direction if we if we give a positive supply it is conducted and if you reverse bias a diode it won't conduct okay the forward characteristics of the diode would be of like this and the reverse characteristics is not symmetrical as a forward characteristics this is a vi characteristic of a diode since diode conducts in only one direction while during forward bias and reverse bias diode won't conduct it has only minimum moment of current so it is not a bilateral element if the if we reverse a polarity of voltage the voltage and current relationship or is not same as the before so it is a unilateral element there are many examples of unilateral element most of the semiconductor devices are unilateral only for example uh, silicon diodes uh, transistors mosfet vacuum diodes and most of the semiconductor devices are unilateral element and those exhibits a property that vi relationship is deferred if you reverse the polarity of the voltages okay so these are the unilateral and bilateral elements